Good morning, and thank you for joining us here on ClickToHouston.com. We're in for another potential of heavy rain. It's mainly going to be later this morning and into the early half of the afternoon. I think the later half of the day will start to dry things out. A 50% chance of rainfall at 10 a.m. That will take us through the lunch hour. The early afternoon, still tracking some scattered storms, but we will clear out before the evening commute. That will allow our temperatures to get a little steamy in the afternoon, up to the low 90s. South winds for today coming in 5 to 10 miles per hour. Our future cast model does keep us quite busy. Uh, during the peak of the morning rush around 7, 8 a.m., a lot of our computer models are pumping out the potential of torrential downpours, also the possibility of lightning. The main impact would be some minor street flooding, so something to keep in mind. You might need some extra time on the roadways. Make sure you check radar before you head out. We'll keep it pretty busy through our lunch hour, but take a look at what happens in the afternoon. The action starts to break apart, still tracking scattered storms, but starting to calm down. And our computer models want to dry us out as early as about 3, 4 p.m., so it looks like we might be able to get in a pool day, at least if you wait into the later half of this afternoon. We have this area of low pressure still creating some disturbed weather that is slowly falling apart and lifting to the north and east, but still holding on for Thursday. So we'll keep in some scattered storms in our forecast for tomorrow, but Friday into the weekend, we slowly dry things out. We'll still see some rain chances, but as this ridge of high pressure starts to move in, we're looking at pop-up afternoon storms instead of these heavy downpours that we've been tracking for the last few days. If you're heading out to Minute Maid Park for the Astros game as we take on the Yankees this evening. A stray shower is still possible heading to the park, but during the game itself, we'll dry things out, so heading home warm and muggy will be close to 80 degrees at 10 p.m. Today, it's going to be a hot day in the low 90s. We'll keep it in the low to mid 90s to close out the work week. Take a look at those rain chances. 50% for today. We'll drop it to 40 for tomorrow, 30 by Friday, and only an isolated shower possible in the afternoon for Saturday and Sunday. The long-term forecast, folks, it's looking pretty hot as we start August. We'll be in the mid to upper 90s next week with mostly sunny skies.